Another Paul McCartney song inspired by a dog. Jet was the lead single off of Wings' Band on the Run album, and another major hit for the group. Paul came up with the title from a litter of puppies one of his dogs had. The tan lab he owned gave birth to a jet black puppy, and he took the title from there. He also incorporated his experiences of riding a horse around his farm. Additionally, the stuck-up Sergeant Major in the lyrics, he said, was a reference to Linda's father, who was a bit old-fashioned. Paul said, I never do a song with the actual words that actually happen, because then it's like a news story. Oh, Linda, I was going to see your dad and he was intimidating. That's a bit boring. So I mask it and mold it into a song, something you can sing reasonably. One of the most confusing aspects of this song is the use of the word suffer a jet, as it doesn't really fit what's going on. Paul said, I make up so much stuff. It means something to me when I do it, and it means something to the record buyer, but if I'm asked to analyze it, I can't really explain what it is. Suffer a jet was crazy enough to work, it sounded silly, so I liked it. The majority of Band on the Run was recorded in Yagos, but this track would be recorded at EMI in London. The song was a major hit when it was released in early 1974, breaking into the top 10 of both the UK and US singles chart. One of the big fans of the song was the group The Carpenters, which surprised Paul. He said, I remember Richard and Karen Carpenter ringing me up to tell me about Jet. They were like the last people on earth I thought would be like, Jet! But they were like, oh, great record, man. So, you know, it was actually resonating with people. The song has since become one of Paul's concert staples and is often cited as one of his many strong solo pieces. The band Jet actually took their name from this song, and many artists have covered it over the years, including the Foo Fighters and Robin Zander of Cheap Trick. It's a really good, fun track. I love the studio version, and the one featured in the opening of Wings Over America is absolutely amazing. In fact, that whole record is really good. You should really check it out. Thank you again so much for watching. If you'd like to help support the channel, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.